fish and anemones have a symbiotic relationship where they both benefit from this association. This is called mutualism. The anemone offers the clownfish protection and the clownfish cleans the anemone in return. If the anemone does strike the clownfish, the clownfish has a thick layer of mucus on it for protection. Uh, 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 forgot to brush. Oh. Do you want this anemone to sting you? Yes. Brush. <sighs> okay, I'm done. Up, you missed here, we have a family of clownfish. They live in what's called an anemone. The anemone is part of the Nidaria family, so they can sting you like a jellyfish. If you are not a clownfish, do not live here. These fish feel no pain when it comes to the harpoon-like strikes of the nematosis, which are the things that sting you. Therefore, clownfish and anemones can live side by side throughout their lives together.